at if it's not handled with wisdom. One concern I have is that there must be great discernment exercised not just by the leadership of our governments but also among the population in general when suddenly our society is confronted with the fact that there are advanced cultures here and what the implications are for our interaction. And even if those who suddenly appear in our midst have only benevolent intentions and truly want only to uplift humanity and assist us at this very crucial time in our planet's history, there will be the temptation for those who are already in the material seats of power in human institutions on this planet who will likely try to distort this opportunity to enhance and entrench their own control and material power. And all that is, it's a continued extension of the same ego disease of the separation mentality that has plagued humanity you know, ever since we learned how to say hello to each other. So we have to call for great discernment. And that means that people need to become educated we need to understand that our source is the same. Erwin Schrodinger, who was the father of quantum mechanics and particle wave theory, stated a hundred years ago or so that the total number of minds in the universe is one. And in fact, that the consciousness is a singularity phasing within all beings.